one of the first things you have to get control of is the health management of your cattle. Vaccination programs and protocols are spelled out in that protocol for that sale. The good thing about the industry over the past 15 years, we've become very uniform in what those specifications are. There's been a protocol that's been developed, it's accepted by the buyers of cattle, and they expect those cattle to be managed under one or two very basic health management pro programs. So that's really not up for debate. You have to decide whether or not you can implement those protocols in a timely fashion and appropriate for this particular sale. All of them will have a minimum days prior to sale that cattle have to be vaccinated. All of them will have a outline of the types of vaccines that have to be given. So they can either be given and those protocols started at the time the calves are processed at what we'd call branding time or two to four months of age. All of the premium calf cells specify that calves have, the steer calves or male calves have to be castrated. Uh, the other aspect of that is that heifers normally would have to be dehorned or they'd prefer they be dehorned. So there's some real specifications that have to be implemented prior to those calves reaching three or four months of age. And so if we're doing the best management practices that we need to do on a set of calves, we have to back up and look at what's happening not only in the breeding program to make sure we're producing calves that fit, but then every management step along the way requires us to do something to get those cattle to, to match up to this marketing channel. 